Hello, Caitlin. Here's some video feedback for you, uh, mostly for Milestone 2. Caitlin, uh, this is looking good. Uh, I enjoy the um, photo collage you made. And um, there's a little bit of scrolling involved, but I think that's, that's fine. Um, I think you've gotten the vertical navigation to fit, uh, to work really well, and it doesn't occupy too much space or display or displace content. So you've got the logo here. It would be good to learn how to make this transparent so that it sits on top of um, photographs as well as solids. But it's a small thing. And the, the best file format for that might be SVG. You might want to take a look at that file format. Uh, I see that you have fleshed out child pages. That's a very appetizing image. And it looks like Caprese. Um, I like the uh, the menu. Watch your spelling here. I see uh, uh, a few misspellings. And also, you know, before you release this, say, into a portfolio or show it to other people um, in a professional context, make sure you get somebody to uh, cast their editorial eye over it to catch, you know, things like that. Uh, see that your child pages, uh, you have placeholders for all your pages. And of them have content, including some of these forms, which I realize, you know, um, requires some um, formatting. So you've got forms for gift cards superimposed on top of, oops, I, I have, um, you know, virus protection, like as many of us do, and it sometimes gives, it, gives me this error message, but we'll just cancel through that. I don't think it matters. You even have a reservation page also with another form, so good going. Very nice job. Navigation remains consistently placed from page to page, and each of your child pages seems to have a distinctive image um, that you've used. Not sure what else to say. Um, little details, you know, I don't know if you need this border here between the image and the navigation, but it is consistent, this gray area. I particularly like this page with its variety of images and your typography. The typography um, is, I think, best on this page, and your size relationships, your hierarchy, this size head against this size text, uh, looks really well. Your line breaks look good, too. You haven't created really long lines or no really short lines. You might be consistent, you know, maybe uh, pick a way of um, indicating type either centered from page to page or flush left, um, you know, maybe two columns. Uh, on all pages, or maybe just a single column, as you see fit. But that would make it a little bit more consistent. I see that you have used the corporate palette in these hairline rules, and this uh, root beer color, I'm assuming, is also a corporate palette. Um, in terms of your code, I see that you have a, a, a or an external style sheet here. Um, looks good. And you have the uh, unordered list, which became your uh, navigation scheme. How, how simple this is. So you have all of your content contained on the HTML, HTML page. And then it looks like you have all of your style on the cascading style sheet. That's a great job, Caitlin. I look forward to seeing uh, you make some you know, refinements. Uh, you might want to flag those in some way, if you can, uh, for the last week. Uh, Caitlin, I also wanted to you know, just bring up these um, wireframes, which are so great. And it looks like you have uh, revised them slightly from week five. Or no, week three, that was the uh, wireframe week. But anyway, you've got, uh, you've got all three of them here. It doesn't look like you deviated too much from um, this first wireframe. You have the vertical navigation and the collage of photographs. Uh, lastly, Caitlin, I see that you have not only browser testing, but also, well, you have some uh, PNGs of brow browser shots of browser testing, and you've given me your uh, <clears throat> Module 6 wireframes, too, which I guess are updated. So good job on that. Might think of ways to you know, maybe uh, collate these into a single document. They're sometimes a little bit difficult to read um, when they're disparate like this. But uh, that's just, you know, that would make it easier for me. But it is, oh, hey, it's good to see what it looks like uh, in your browser.
That's really nice. Nice, elegant typography. You've got the corporate typeface here to work. Uh, that's that Gaudi old style. Good job. Okay, I can't think of anything else to add to this, but uh, don't hesitate to reach out if you have questions.